so hey guys welcome back once again and in this video i'm gonna talk something more important about stable diffusion the thing that you need to take into consideration that thing that you need to be also aware of while working on stable diffusion so let's get started so first of all let me thank two of my subscribers that we had a discussion over this topic in my comment section as you can clearly see over here what was this topic first of all let me tell you one of the subscribers just asked me which one should you select dot ckpt or dot safe tensor so which one you should go with and what are these files okay so let me tell you this video is just to make you aware of these things okay whenever you work with stable diffusion okay so let's get started so the first and the most important thing about stable diffusion or working on automatic 1111 is that whenever you work on stable diffusion you work with certain models so what are these models so these models are dot ckpt files and dot safe tensor files so which one you should go with dot ckpt or dot safe tensor which one is safe for you to use so i'm not gonna go in deep in this video okay i'm just making this video in order for you to be aware of these things okay you need to take these things into consideration so let me tell you one thing whenever you go on to downloading a model you will see two files over here as you can see over here i'm already on hugging face dreamlike diffusion model page so you can clearly see over here there are two files dot ckpt files and dot save tensor file in front of ckpt you will see pickle written over here if you see pickle written on any of the files you need to be aware of one thing okay what is this pickle and what you need to be aware of this let me tell you in detail very quickly so right now i'm here in pickle scanning page as you can clearly see so what is pickle actually pickle is a widely used format it is a default format for pytorch model weights you can clearly see over here and yeah it's already written over here there are dangerous arbitrary code execution attacks that can be prepared when you load a pickle file actually whenever you download .ckpt file it may contains a malicious code so whenever you run that .ckpt file on your pc on stable diffusion it may contain malicious code that can harm your pc okay so you need to be aware of this first thing okay so whenever you download these files just like you can see over here i'm on dreamlike diffusion page whenever you download this file just see if it's pickle written over here if it's pickle written over here it may contain malicious code okay so whenever you download this file you can just cross check using your antivirus okay if you have an antivirus on your pc you can just cross check okay if there is a malicious code on this file your antivirus can detect it okay malicious trojan can be detected by antivirus not every antivirus can detect it but yes you need to be aware of this and just for a cross check you need to go scan with antivirus okay so the next thing that i'm going to talk about is that dot safe tensors file what are dot safe tensors file so now that you know that dot ckpt file with pickle in it can contain malicious code in it okay it can harm your pc for this in order to make it safe dot safe tensors files are made as you can clearly see as you can already see that they are experimenting with new simple serialization format called dot safe tensors okay so these file dot safe tensors files are safe to use rather than choosing dot ckpt file now remember one thing very clearly not every model that you go on to download will have safe tensors file okay for that you need to go with dot ckpt file so just remember one thing whenever you download dot ckpt file just be aware of this thing that it may contain malware code okay that can run into your pc for this just cross verify just cross scan it on your antivirus so if it has a malware code then it will detect already okay so you need to cross verify this okay just example whenever i go on to download on civit ai website you will find tons of model over here okay if you are new to this you will find tons of models over here so now when you go on to download any model from civic air website just like protogen like let me open protogen and let me show you one thing you will find an arrow over here and you will see there is two models over here first of all model pickle tensor and model safe tensor same thing for prune model pickle tensor and prune model safe tensor okay so for this you need to go with safe tensor only as you already know now that safe tensors are safe for use not pickle tensors these are dot ckpt file and these are dot safe tensors file similarly as i said already that not every model that you get will have safe tensor just like this okay so let me show you this model if you click on download over here you will see that it will automatically download dot ckpt file so not every model do you get will have safe tensors file okay first thing you need to know about this so for this you need to cross verify cross scan on antivirus to just check if it doesn't has malware code in it 
so that's why i made this video in order for you to know in order to make you aware of this thing that which file you should select dot ckpt or dot save tensor as you know now that dot ckpt are not safe to use you can use i'm not recommending it to not to use okay you can use that file as well but make sure that you cross check about the malware code in it you need to scan it okay first of all to make sure that it doesn't has malware code okay so that's it for today i hope you guys like this video and this was just a video to make you aware these things okay so that's why i didn't go much into detail about this video this was just for you to make you aware of this okay so that's it for today and i will be back with more videos tomorrow and till then have a good day have a great day bye guys love you all guys bye guys stay safe bye guys love you all guys bye guys